Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Advice to Think Twice. My name is Monica and I'm here with your weekly advice for work and finances for the week starting March 13th, 2017. Thank you for joining me. Uh, as usual, please remember that these are general readings so they're probably not going to apply to everybody watching. Make sure to watch your moon and rising sign for additional messages. And of course, if you would like a private reading specific to just you, all the links you need are in the description box below. Uh, remember to check out the spring specials and the 13 for 13 special uh, currently running. I uh, hope we have fun with those. And uh, without further ado, let's jump in and see what the week holds for each of the signs. Okay, so I'll talk to you in a bit. Enjoy your readings and have a great week. Take care. Hi Virgo and welcome to your reading for the week. Let's have a look what's coming up for you. Have awesome cards here by the way. So at the bottom of the deck, you have the Six of Pentacles as your overall energy for the week when it comes to work, finances, studies, um, that kind of area of your life. Um, the Six of Pentacles is a really good card. It talks about money coming to you, financial support um, coming your way, things that you ask for, you will probably receive. It's also a card that is asking you to be balanced with your spending, be balanced with your expectations, be balanced with what you're asking for. Um, be fair, okay, if someone deserves help, help them. If someone is uh, lying to you or trying to deceive you in any kind of a way, um, then the balanced, the healthy thing to do is to say, no, thank you, I can't do that, okay? Uh, so it's just about being discerning and balanced with spending and your approach to money, what you're asking for, okay? And also what you're accepting uh, in your life as well. Um, it's definitely good news from banks, good news from lenders, good news from people you've asked for money from, okay? Uh, it's probably going to come to you with the Six of Pentacles. For those of you, this is about you being in a, in a giving disposition this week, okay? Doing work for charity or giving money away uh, to charity or to just people who ask you for help, okay? Again, just double check, make sure that they're asking it for they're going to spend it on what they're asking you for that money and not on different things, okay? Because for some of you, I am seeing someone gambling, coming to you, telling you that they need money for rent, and then they're going to gamble it away. So just be mindful of that, okay? Your other cards here, we have the Page of Cups, the Nine of Cups, and the Hierophant. For some of you, this talks about pulling your money together with another person because you are now committed to each other, okay? This is a proposal, the yes, and the talks of marriage, okay? And you're pulling your money together. That's where your money is seeing changes, uh, improvements. For others of you, this is about a job offer coming your way. Um, maybe for the government, for schools, um, any big institution. Um, with the Hierophant here, universities, that sort of thing. Being a private tutor could be that as well, okay, and that's your side business, or it could be something that you do full time. Um, and it sees you being very content with that. It sees you being very content with that offer, with that proposition. It will balance out your finances. It will balance out uh, what you can spend and what you can put aside, what you, you can save. This is also receiving the yes from a bank, okay? Receiving the yes from a bank. So uh, being approved for credit, being approved for a loan, being approved for a mortgage, personal loan, car loan, loan for studies, could be that as well. But this is approval, okay? You've got the page of cups, talk about offers, opportunities, um, positive conversations, okay? The Nine of Cups talking about your yes answer, wish coming true, getting the wish, getting the answer. And then the Hierophant talking about partnerships, unions, um, making something official, making something formal, um, climbing the ladder, okay, with the Hierophant as well. Receiving blessings, receiving answers once again, okay, it's all about receiving the answers you're looking for, receiving what you've asked for this week in terms of job, in terms of... Um, Climbing the ladder, so any sort of advancement or bonus or anything like that, okay? Um, raises as well. And approvals, okay, getting approved or 
um, if you've applied for things with the Page of Cups, if you've been applying, if you've been applying, then you're hearing back from these people and you're hearing some good things, okay? They're offering you jobs. They're offering you a partnership. They're offering you um, the opportunity to join their company. Further, it could be like a family business. It could be your business or it could be you joining a family business. Further, this feels like two, two different options. One of them is the safe option, slightly boring and predictable. And further, this is following the dream, pursuing a dream. You need money for this, so you're looking at getting a loan for your business or getting a loan for your dream. And if that falls through, you have this job that you can fall back on. Or this is about a choice between the two and you're weighing up your options. For others of you, this is about getting a loan or a mortgage, something that's big or long term, and you have to conform to the rules of the bank or you have to conform to the rules of the person lending you that money. Okay, you're going to them. They're sitting and pretty. They will give you what you're asking for. They will have rules. They will have uh, strings attached, which is you know the case with any kind of a loan. But it will be given to you, okay? For some of you, this is about making things official. If you're dating someone at work, I feel like you could be talking to HR about it this week. And it's just about doing the right thing. It's not going to impact anything else, okay? It's just letting them know. For those of you, this is about rec receiving money for maternity leave or paternity leave. That's the phrase. Um, because as a child, there's joy and celebration, there's taking a break, the end of a phase, and then there's being supported, okay? Further, the Hierophant represents um, the government, if you're asking for financial support, benefits of any kind, anything like that, or child support from another person, it will be granted to you this week. I feel like it will come with some strings attached though with the Hierophant, there's a need to conform to something. And it's either if you conform to this, you have it, and if not, sorry, we can't help you. So it could be something like that going on. For those of you, the Hierophant represents family, family tradition, family rules. Your elders. Someone who sees you as a child and, and still inexperienced, regardless of the fact if you're 30 or 40, okay, they're still seeing you as a child. And so I feel that it could be, you know, someone stepping on their pride and asking these people for support, asking these elders for support. And you're conforming, so you have to do what they say, you have to listen to them, you have to hear them out, okay, so you're kind of stepping on your pride to do this, but they will help you, they will help you. For those of you, this is about putting a file together. You could be looking at retirement, something you've been working your way to uh, for a while now. And I feel like you hear good news about that or your proposition towards that is accepted. Like you say, look, I wanna retire at this date. And they're saying, okay, well, you have to do this and this and this, and you have to put this in your file and this and this and this. But in the end, they're giving you good news. Yes, they're accepting your proposition. Yes, you have everything you need in that file to be approved. And so you're going to get the money or you're going to get the uh, whatever it is you're asking for really, okay, with the Six of Pentacles. It doesn't have to involve just money. It is support, okay, support, help, someone being benevolent, trying to help you, okay. Uh, so it can be about money, but it can be about anything else as well. For those of you, um, this is something around child support. It 
you may be asked to pay child support this week and you have to conform especially if you know your spouse or ex is a water sign cancer scorpio pisces they got legal teams involved okay so now you have to conform to the rules so for some of you um there's that going on it will be fair okay it won't be impossible expectations but you still have to um, conform to it For others, this is all about new job opportunities, new job opportunities, new clients, people offering to work with you. It's also about investors contacting you, wanting to collaborate with you, wanting to invest in your business, wanting to fund something that you're very proud of, okay, something that you're doing and you're very proud of. So that's seeing you, you know, receiving money, okay, from that kind of a direction. For those of you, if someone is trying to help you, let them help you, okay? I'm seeing some sort of a hesitation, reservation um, in terms of someone trying to help you. You're either thinking that this person is going to have uh, a million strings attached to their help, um, or you're thinking that I don't know if I should trust this person or not. And if that's the case, just double check. Okay, get your facts in order, double check. Ask the questions that you have. Ask for what you deserve, ask for what you expect. Negotiate, okay? It doesn't have to be black and white, but you never really know until you ask. So if that's the case, just ask and have that conversation, have that negotiation. But job seems to be improving. Money seems to be on, on its way to improving. Um, this week, lots of approvals, grants, permits given, support received or offered to you. So it should be a pretty good week, okay? I'm looking forward to your comments. Let me know how these cards make sense to you if they apply to you and how things are going for you in the week. I hope you do have a fantastic week and I hope that um, it will be everything you've been working your way towards and better. Okay, so have a great time and I'll talk to you again soon. Take care.